things a doctor or nurse will do in the office visit is check your blood pressure. If you get that look, eh, that's what you don't want. We're talking about high <laughs> blood pressure today with Dr. Shiesta. Dave, millions of people have a high blood pressure problem, but unfortunately, significant number of these people have no idea they have it. That's why they call it silent killer because there's no specific symptom involved. However, high blood pressure can have a significant health consequences. Dave, chronic high blood pressure is one of the major risk factors for developing stroke and heart disease. Entire vascular system arteries are damaged mm. by chronic high blood pressure and also includes the kidney failure, most of them caused by high blood pressure. Even eyes are not spared. So the impact in the body health-wise is really significant. Is it easy to lower high blood pressure? Actually, it's extremely easy. The first thing we have to know what is our number? This is really okay. critical, just knowing your cholesterol number. You should know your blood pressure. Any blood pressure 120 over 80 or less is wonderful. However, when the blood pressure between 120, 139, and 80, 89, lower blood pressure, that means you're prehypertensive. And Dave, it's interesting that even being in this range more than doubles the risk of heart disease. Ew. And if your blood pressure 140 over 90, then definitely that's a significant amount of a problem. You should be taking action immediately. Of course, the question is, what causes high blood pressure problem? Mm -hmm. One of the major contributing factors, Dave, for high blood pressure, having abdominal fat. What it does affects some of the hormones, such as insulin, and insulin increases the sodium retention from the kidney, and that contributes to blood volume and blood pressure. So it's very important that if you have any blood pressure problem, it's amazing, dropping even 10 pounds, Dave, can improve that blood pressure, and in most cases, losing five to 10 pounds, 10% 10 of your weight, can completely correct abnormality without no need for medication. Another problem that's really important, Dave, having a regular exercise, nothing fancy. Just walking 15 minutes away from house and coming back, that's 30 minutes of exercise. That not only helps you to uh, w lose weight, but also affects your stress hormone come down and lowers your blood pressure. One of the major core of uh, prevention and reversing blood pressure is nutrition. Dave, Cutting down sodium, saturated fat in your diet, and adding plenty of fresh fruit and vegetables is a critical com component of dealing with blood pressure. Because these vegetables and, uh, and fruits have a significant amount of antioxidant that protects your arteries, loaded with potassium which relaxes your arteries, and low fat uh, dairy products such as skim milk and uh, fat-free yogurt also has a calcium that helps to control the blood pressure. Basically, with the combination of a small amount of exercise, a small amount of weight loss, and paying attention to nutrition, all of us can take control of our blood pressure. And when you do that, your doctors and nurses smile at you. They're, they're happy, happy to see absolutely. you. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Remember, if you see Dr. Say after your first consultation is always free, you can give them a call at 729-9665.